I'm looking to set up a new Linux system but I'm confused between Ubuntu, Debian, CentOS, and Fedora. Can you help me understand the key differences? What would you like to know first? Well, what's the main purpose or target audience for each of these distributions? Here's a clear breakdown. Ubuntu, aimed at everyday users, emphasizes user-friendliness and desktop computing. It's great for beginners. Debian, focuses on stability and free software principles. Popular among experienced users and servers. CentOS, primarily used for servers and enterprise environments. It's basically Red Hat Enterprise Linux, RHEL, without the cost. Fedora, acts as a testing ground for future RHEL features. Great for developers and tech enthusiasts who want cutting edge software. What about package management? I heard they use different systems. Yes, they fall into two main families. APT, Advanced Package Tool, used by Ubuntu and Debian. Uses .dev packages. DNF slash yum. Used by CentOS and Fedora. Uses .rpm packages. How often do these distributions release updates? The release cycles are quite different. Ubuntu, regular releases every six months with LTS, long-term support, versions every two years. Debian, new stable versions roughly every two years. CentOS, major versions follow RHEL, typically every few years. Fedora, New version every six months. What about system requirements? Do they differ significantly? Here's a general overview of minimum requirements. Ubuntu. Two gigabytes RAM. 25 gigabytes storage. 2 GHz dual core processor. Debian. 512 megabytes RAM. 10 GB storage. 1 GHz processor. CentOS. 2 GB RAM. 20 gigabyte storage, 1.1 gigahertz processor, Fedora, Should old acquaintance be 2 gigabytes RAM, and never brought to mind. 20 gigabyte storage, old acquaintance be 1 gigahertz processor, which one would you recommend for a server? CentOS, best for enterprise level servers needing long term stability. Debian, excellent for reliable, secure servers with good community support. Ubuntu Server, good for cloud deployments and container workloads. Fedora, generally not recommended for production servers due to short life cycle. 
And for a desktop user coming from Windows? I'd recommend Ubuntu for these reasons. Most user-friendly interface. Largest community for support. Best hardware compatibility. Extensive software availability through Ubuntu Software Center. Regular updates with latest features. A cup of kindness yet for all. Thanks. This really helps clear things up. Any final tips? Remember. Ubuntu. Best for beginners and desktop users. Debian. Perfect if you value stability and free software. CentOS, ideal for enterprise servers. Fedora, great for developers and bleeding edge features.